Is it required to take the UAE residence visa? Yes. Tune into this video. Watch it until the end as we try to know what is required of you, what are you supposed to do, and why it's very important or why it's mandatory for you to have a medical test for the UAE residence visa. Hi guys, welcome back to this channel and if it's your first time to come across this channel, please consider subscribing to this channel. Press the notification bell, it will be the only way you will be updated when we upload or when I upload something new for you. Remember, it's the only platform that we can get to learn one another, we can get to share information in one or the other, information regarding personal development, information regarding jobs in the Gulf countries. We will look at travel and travel restrictions and any other travel experiences that you may want to know in this or on this channel. Remember, it's Mix from the Mix Creation TV. Is it required of you to have a medical test for the UAE residence visa? When we talk about the UAE, we are looking at countries, we are looking at uh, the seven emirates that make up the UAE, Dubai, Abu Dhabi and other emirates that we have to talk about. Remember, most of these countries, most of these countries, they do require you to take a medical test. Why? What is the reason for that? Is it just for fun? Is it that they want to make money? No. It is because they want to secure their population away from what we call the contagious diseases. Remember, when we are talking about the contagious diseases, some of these diseases they are trying, they are trying to blow into their population is that they make someone medically unfit. And some of these diseases are they have gone away with in some of developed countries they've done away with such kind of diseases so they feel insecure if someone is coming from a foreign country or someone outside their country to come in with such kind of diseases yes i'm going to read through you i'm going to read for you what exactly is published on what we call the uae ministry of public health website that is regarding the medical test in the residence medical test as you're trying to get what we call a residence visa remember when we are talking about the residence visa we are looking at a visa where you're going to stay in the uae for more than six months maybe you are going to be in the uae for work so they require of you to have taken a medical test or medical test that will prove to you that you are known, you are fit for that particular work that you are going to do and that you are fit to live with the population in that area. That's why you need to take a medical test. But remember, the medical test does not start only in UAE. Normally, this medical test, test starts right away from your country of origin where you need to first check yourself or you need to first check out yourself before you can move to some of these countries because it becomes part of the requirements in all other foreign countries to move. Let me get through what is written on the government website regarding the medical test. Yes, it is mandatory for all expatriates seeking to obtain work permits or a residence visa in the UAE to be certified as a medically fit and free of contagious diseases. This is to ensure that the foreign nationals must provide proof in form of medical reports from the medical examination centers in the UAE. What are we talking about? That much as you may do the medical examinations or the medical tests in your country, these are not the final results you'll have to do other medical test results or other medical test examinations in the UAE 
that must be certified by the government itself or the government responsible body that is responsible for that by the self and that is what will prove to you that you are physically or you are fit to work in that population or you are even fit to do that particular job that you recruited to or that particular job that you're thinking you're going to do at that time. The ministry further say or the government further say that in order for the UAE to grant or renew residence visa for the expatriates, the males, the females have to undergo or pass what we call the medical fitness test at the government approved healthy centers in the UAE. Remember, when we're talking about the UAE, we are talking about the seven Emirates that make up the UAE. Among them is Dubai and Abu Dhabi. I think that is the final most final destination for most of people that go to UAE. But remember, these medical fitness tests are normally carried out by the Afro approved and accredited government centers that are supposed to carry out that test and prove how fit or medical fit to work in the UAE. The ministry or the government further says that if you apply for a visa visa or a tourist visa, or in case if you want to renew the same, you do not need to get a medical test done. Remember, when we are talking about a visit visa or when you talk about a tourist visa, this is sometimes it's a short stay visa. What does it mean? That you will not be required to take the medical the same time another time in case you take the first medical if you are going to stay in the country for more than six months or for more than that time. That if at one moment of time you hope to renew that visa or you need to change that visa into what you call a residence visa. And when you talk about the residence visa, we are talking about a visa whereby you are going to permanently stay in that area, in that country or in that place or you are going to get something to do or work in that area. So meaning that at that time you will have to do what we call the full medicals for you to have the residence permit given to you. When we talk about the residence permit, we probably definitely we are talking about what we call being issued what we call a residence permit card that will grant you or that will certify that you are physically fit and you are allowed to live in this country at this time. Yes, still it says the standard medical screening involves screening for what you call communicable diseases such as hepatitis, HIV, leprosy, syphilis, tuberculosis to ensure the community health is very safe away from any harm. Hope guys this is very clear especially people are seeking work, people are coming from uh, from these other countries. Uh, we know, we all look to this area as final destinations where we need to get something or we need to get uh, greener pastures or we need to get brain, uh, brain, uh, brain winning situations at one moment or time. So meaning that wherever you are trying to try to plan to travel to these countries, make sure that you've tested physically fit or you've tested out of any of such kind of diseases or such kind of scenarios I mentioned about. Because remember, they will have to prove it to you. They'll have to prove out that whatever you provided is right or whatever you provided is exactly, uh, exactly that makes you fit to go and work or live inside that population. Remember, when we talk about communicable body diseases uh, to such kind of countries, uh, most of these things have been dealt with for a long period of time. So they would not want to, um, to, to again invite in another scenario where the population will be at harm. Hope we've tried to share something, especially people who are coming from Africa, people who are coming from these Asia countries. Let us try to be very strict, especially with the uh, recruitment manpowers from those countries or from our countries or wherever we are coming from. Let them not force out results for you because remember, when we are applying these jobs, we are applying these kind of jobs, we normally put in what we call our inputs. And when you put in inputs, you will get 
uh, disappointed in one way because if you fit you if you prove physically unfit if you prove uh, medically unfit after the medicals are being done in the UAE you will probably be deported immediately with immediate uh, you'll be deported back to your country so that means at the end of it all you'll be having to lose out whatever you had to put in uh, to that manpower company at one moment of time in yourself so make sure as you try to prepare your journey to go to some of these countries for work you know, any related issue you probably need to know that you need to prepare yourself and know that I have to present those results that are genuinely uh, being tested and I'm not in any of that category being positive of such kind of situation that they do not require in their country. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel. By the way, feel free to drop a comment in the section, in the comment section, I'll always be more than happy to get back to you. By the way, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. We are looking at a road to 2,000 subscribers. It is only your effort, it's only your support that we get to that level. So we are looking at uh, a road to one to 2,000 subscribers. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel. Thank you so much for joining this channel. Tune in for the next video as we try to see more of the medical medical uh, procedures the latest medical procedures in the uae thank you so much see you again in the next video it's mix from the mix creation